Hey guys, Leslie with Fit One Wellness here, back with another non-traditional workout. Today, we're actually using a very traditional piece of equipment in a very non-traditional way. I've taken an aluminum broom handle and I have fixed a 25 pound kettlebell to one end. In order to do that, I used one of the 41 inch power bands. I used the black half inch. My goal here was to create as close of a relationship between the two entities as I possibly could, as I didn't want the kettlebell moving around on me while I determined how safe it is. Obviously, if I'm gonna share this with you, we can't have any broken toes out there. So this is a work in progress for me, and I've just been playing around with it a little bit today, and I'm hoping that there'll be a lot more to come with this. So today I told uh, one of my clients I woke up thinking about different ways we could use the broom handle in a non-traditional way. And she laughed and said, well, that's perfect because tomorrow is a full moon. And I thought, huh, that's great. So tomorrow I plan on coming at you with a full broom, full moon workout. <laughs> well, that'll be the star of the show here. All right, so here's the deal. Wow, this is so much work. Just holding this at my waist. I've got to try to control what wants to go this way, right? So I've got to really control this with my opposite arm. Now, I'm gonna clean this up to my shoulders here, hopefully, so I can show you a little bit of what I've been playing around with. So I'm gonna do a strict press. With this offset weight, my whole body whew, has to work very hard to make this happen. This is crazy hard, 25 pounds, and I have to work so hard to squat it. What's really important here is that we keep the bar horizontal, whew, and we are working to keep this pasted against the collarbone or chest. Super important. Whew. You're gonna find, if you struggle with shoulder flexibility, mobility, you might struggle with this workout. So. One of the things that's gonna to wanna to happen to you here is this bar is going to want to pull away from your chest on the opposite side. You're not gonna let it happen. Now, there's another way I can make this a little more challenging. It's by where I position my hand in relation whew, to that load. In this case, that 25 pound whew, kettlebell, wow. And you see just me moving a couple of inches. Oh my goodness. Oh, it changes the load entirely. And this is extremely hard. This is a mega challenge for me just to lift that. Ooh. You're not going to do this to get a limiting one rep max. You're going to lighten the load up overall, but really increase the strength, the strength of your core with these moves. I hope you'd enjoyed this version of non-traditional workout. And I'm hoping to see your creativity too. What ways are you using this? How about we try to affix a light dumbbell to it tomorrow? Let's see what happens. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you again soon.